एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू ईयर सेवन चैप्टर सेवनटीन फॉगज मिस्ट्री या दैट्स इट दैट दैट्स देर इज नथिंग एल्स फॉर दिस इंटर ऑल्सो आई कॉन्ट हियर माई सेल्फ टूडे आई कॉन्ट हियर माई सेल्फ थिंग टूडे एंड माई फीट रियली हर्ट विजिट कोरी इन द हॉस्पिटल विंग या बिकॉज इफ वी रिमेंबर करेक्टली देर वॉज अ रैंडम डॉक सी दैट बिट हिम ऑन द फिंगर वंस अगेन गुड मॉर्निंग टू एवरी वन आई होप यू आर हैविंग अ गुड डे दिस इज यर सेवन चैप्टर सेवनटीन आई थिंक एक्सिडेंटली सेट यर सिक्स एंड द फर्स्ट थिंग यू डूंग इज विजिटिंग कोरी एंड you know this is actually the first time the hospital wing we visited uh, since you know everything came back to normal uh, no one was required in the hospital wing like before that i know i'm making no sense but look okay i just woke up okay my brain isn't fully functional yet hi kiara you know most sort of gods madam pomfrey i'll find some more okay gods which reminds me my foot and there we go the count of serum should kick in soon I have no idea what happened to this kid, and I am actually kind of curious because Penny is helping. What happened to Andre? I do not know. And what happened to this girl? I don't know either. And what he is doing here? That I don't know either. It's Rahi, right? You uh, seem like an alright sort. Oh, okay. Um, thank you. I don't know what intro to give. I just woke up and I sat down and I'm like, wait, I don't have an intro. <clears throat> Cody, how are you feeling? I was worried after that doxy bit. You, Whoa. no need to be worried, sir. I am already on the mend, thanks to Madam Pomfrey. Madam Pomfrey, I should be ready to get back to our special project soon. Mm -hmm. Not so fast, Mr. Hayden. You need to rest. Madam Pomfrey is right, Cody. You should be resting. Our investigation can wait until you're uh, ready to be released. <laughs> But mm -hmm. if I get you out of bed, you'll have worse things to worry about than a doxy bite. Jeez. There are enough students suffering from doxy bites as is. I don't need to worry about you being up and about. How long does it take to recover from a doxy bite anyway? Wait, Madam Bobby, are all these students suffering from doxy bites? That is correct, Miss Silver. There are so many. In fact, that I have had to enlist some help. Ah, that's where Penny comes in. Okay. How does Victor manage to look cool doing anything? He's so charismatic. Why are you obsessing over it? And he just carried in a student earlier, like it was no big deal. The strength he has is mad. What Barnaby does that every other day? Are you still on about that, Cory? He's just a student, just like us. Speaking of which, with there being so many students that you need help, um, does that mean there's a doxy infestation, Madam Mumphrey? There very well could be, though we're not certain yet. I mean, there was a random doxy in the artifact room. I'm not surprised. If you're going to keep asking questions, Miss Silvers, then you can, at the very least, help out. Yeah, that's fine. Of course, Madam Pomfrey, I'll get started right away helping students. I once again forgot to get a glass of water. Ah, uh, there's something to. Okay. Why do you take me over there, camera, when there is nothing to pick over there? There's got to be some extra bandages in here. When did the students start getting bit, Madam Pomfrey? Ah, uh, seriously, before the trial started, we have this. This doxy investigation is going to be the equivalent of the prank arc in year five. I, I'm telling you. When you get a free moment, we should talk about it. You know, we can do that later, right? I actually don't want to. Obviously, we need more counter serum. It should. Oh God, why are you so angry? I don't have time to waste. There are so many designs I have to perfect, dude. Calm down! I don't need new clothes that badly. I seriously don't. Hi, Sahi. I'm glad you're here to help. Penny, you're just everywhere. I'm so bored of you. Don't just stand around. Come help with the student. Yes, come in. I don't know what to do. So I've only recently started getting bitten. How recently? Yesterday. Okay, I ran out of things to make clicking seem entertaining. Okay, I ran out of things to say to make clicking seem entertaining. I'm very sorry. According to Madam Pomfrey, students have only recently been getting bit by doxies, and the attacks are happening all over Hogwarts. I need to stop. They they are not localized to a specific place. Tell me about it. I got bitten while looking through my collection of fabrics. I'll never look at a uh, at a hound a hound's tooth the same way again. That side is it. I have to get to the bottom of the dock. Seriously. 
the amount of things that mc does i don't understand oh. why i'll help you you heard bad up of recovery you need to rest besides it's just some doxies what's worse that could happen you could get bit and end up in the hospital wing we've dealt with far worse you know doxies are a nice break from chasing down dark wizard cabals i suppose but you don't think it's a bit suspicious that hogs is a doxy infestation hmm what if hearts said to the name of doxy is distract you i don't think so i honestly I don't think this is the work of our Cory. It's probably just another regular doxy infestation. I don't know about that, Sirahi. I won't discredit the idea so quickly. One time, Confucian persons were distracted by vampire mosques releases. Vampire mosques. Okay, vampire mosques. One time, Confucian persons were distracted by vampire mosques released by the evil doctor Guzander. If it will make you feel better, I'll keep an eye out, but I really don't think this has anything to do with our. And if you found out anything, you should report back to me. I don't know if Papi told me to rest, but uh, what about Marula? We still have to talk about it. If, if it's possible, we could use her as double agent against our. Again, I will not ask Marula for that. I don't. I'm. This is not something I will ask of her. I don't want to. And if the game makes me, I, 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 I seriously. I don't even know, man. Jam Shooty is just so bad. We should talk about her approach right away. We need to make sure we say the right things to her. I appreciate your tenacity, Cory, but dealing with Marula will have to wait until this infestation is over. It's more important that no one else gets bitten. I can't worry about Marula while my friends are in danger. Now, if I want to get to the bottom of this doxy mystery, I ought to talk to a creature expert. That damn it! It's time to see Professor Kettleburn. I was hoping we'd see Barbara. Kiara was just in the hospital wing. Did she come with me? Ah, Miss Silvers, I don't suppose you're also here about the doxy infestation. I am. Though it looks like Kiara got here before me. I was with Andre when he was bitten, and I thought I would I would investigate the attacks to put an end to them. I'm an aspiring healer, and I hate to see people suffer. Uh, by the way, we are going to go to Saint Mungo's with Kiara, which is very cute. Maybe we could team up. Yeah, sure. Two heads are better than one. That is even better when you consider the runes for. Three is even better when you consider the runes for. Sorry, I can't read. My brain is still mostly asleep. I should be awake by now, but it's still asleep. And my feet also still hurt. I think the reason I'm feeling sleepy is because my feet hurt, which makes no sense. But then again, this chapter is only filler. Let's team up, Kiara. Let's get one more try. Brilliant. Then we'll take on this pestilence together. First things first. What can you tell us about Doxy's professor? I'm pretty sure we know a lot about Doxy's already. I can tell you anything and everything, as you two help me finish feeding these fire crabs. Right, it's always the fire crabs. How about I just skip over feeding the fire crabs and get straight to the plot? I'm glad we skipped that because that took too long. Oh, and by the way, I know that. Uh, I haven't started this video very well, but it is my birthday tomorrow. So it sounds like if this really is a doxy infestation, we need more than the doc packagings to help. Yeah. Technically, you could defeat every single doxy with the doc packagings. It would just take a ridiculous amount of time. But then, what do we do, Professor? I think we need a potion in our third year. But I can't seem to recall the name. Do we? Do you remember, Sahi? Doxy be gone. That actually sounds much funnier. Doxy side. I'm fairly certain it's doxy side. That's right. It's a good thing you remember, Sahi. Fantastic! Since uh, Professor Snape isn't here, I'll award five points for Hufflepuff in his stead. Huh? Thank you, Professor Kettleburn. I'm not sure Professor Snape would have awarded me house points for that, but I appreciate it. So, where are we going to get Doxy's head? We could just brew it. Professor Snape might have some. What I mean, he's got won't nearly be enough for an entire swarm. You need to brew more. And to brew more, you need to see Professor Sprout for the ingredients. I'm pretty sure Professor Sprout will understand our situation. Doxy infestation is serious business. She'll be happy that two Hufflepuff students are helping with the school problem. I'll send her an email and let her know we'll be visiting. Fantastic idea, Kayara. Let's wait at the dean house to get the ingredients and brew some doxy side and get rid of these doxies. I don't know if doxy side is going to go on all of them. Yay, Barbie! I'm happy to see him. There you two are. We've got quite the workload ahead of us. Of course, Professor Sprout. Hi, Sraggy. Hi, Kiara. Hi, Barnaby. 
What are you doing here? I'm happy to see you. As I said before, we've got quite the workload ahead of us. We do, and thank you for agreeing to help us, Professor. If we truly have a doxy infestation on our hands, Mr. Boska, then it is my job to help the students. Andre and Cory are already in the hospital wing. We have to make sure no one else ends up there. I will instruct Mr. Lee's help with gathering of the ingredients. Why am I asking questions? Brilliant. Between the four of us, we have to finish in no time at all. I wish everything I did took no time at all. If that is not a boot, I don't know what is. Just the other day, I was trying to finish my portion. They say, but it took me nine hours. Again, mood. And then, okay, okay, no, not on a tangent right now. <laughs> this task will take nine hours if you keep on Mr. Lee. But with a sprout side ban, maybe you should get started right away. Although you you are free to rant later, it is I try very hard not to rant about how hard my feet hurt. The amount of walking I did yesterday is too much. I did too much walking. We need to save the school, and I don't want to see any more of our friends in the hospital wing. Exactly, it's important that we. Okay, yes, you keep reiterating that we need hemlock, tormental, and cowbane. Professor Snape can turn those into necessary. What? Into the necessary ingredients. What? What? Correct, Mr. Boska. Wait for what? Now everyone, put your glass on and get a harvesting. I am a little confused. Okay, so yeah, it is my birthday tomorrow. Tomorrow is uh, gonna be 11 September. It's my birthday, and it's also Sarahi's birthday. So Sarahi and I have the same birthday. I have not made anything. This year for Sarahi's birthday, and I don't know what to do. Should have been okay. What did you do? Why? What did you do? Did you cut something wrong? You didn't cut yourself, did you? You didn't actually do that, did you? Can you hold this while I clip some leaves of uh, cold water? It's good that you're here to help. Okay, thank you. Doxide will neutralize doxies. You'll still need to move them out of the castle. Oh. Yeah, I knew it. I, it's not gonna work. This isn't gonna work. I have to confess that I'm feeling a bit guilty about the doxy situation. Why? 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 Why?
Vitamins are found everywhere, but I don't know the near the school ground. <laughs> when in doubt, try Hagrid's garden. That's right, he did have a Bundaman bend infestation on our fourth year that I had to deal with. Right after all, was getting murdered by Ben. Maybe they've come back. Don't hurt luck. Let's go to Hagrid's garden and find some Bundaman news. We'll need some to do this job instead and save the school. Stop reiterating things. I think the worst thing about this game isn't how pointless everything some things are. It is about how some things keep getting repeated and reiterated. Yes, I get the point already. Stop repeating it. Oh, chocolate frog. Okay, what do we got? Oh, Celestina Warbeck. Okay. Thank you. Oh my god, the amount of things I have in Hagrid's garden. I have still not done any of those creature credit quests and that includes the quintapid one that came out god knows how many months ago. Well, there's a Bundaman right there. I think if we're going to find Bundaman in Bundamans anywhere, then Hagrid's Garden is a good place to start. Yeah, something wrong, Barnaby? No, maybe yes. Dude, what happened? What is wrong with you? Do you need some help for something? Don't worry, Barnaby. We'll find a Bundaman and get some moose and get rid of the doxies. We'll be able to stop it. Stop reiterating things. I have no doubt that we'll fix this, Sarahi. You're here after all and you're able to fix everything. I know he means this as a compliment, but um, I feel it, it's actually kind of insulting that MC has to be fixing everything ever. I know he means it as a compliment. It's just me personally. But we wouldn't be here if it weren't for me and the doxy that accidentally got into my rope pocket. Please, no, my boy, stop, stop blaming yourself, no. It was an accident. And as I said before, it wasn't your fault. Please stop blaming yourself, my sweet boy. It's really hurting me to see you sad. What matters now is that you're here to help get rid of the doxies. Exactly. But what if? No what ifs. Also, abandonment. Quick, everyone, try to stand it before it gets away. That is an extremely random Bundaman. Wait, what did? Get back here. Imagine if you don't play this sequence and the Bundaman just comes away and then you just can't play this sequence. Like, you tap on the exclamation mark after the Bundaman is off screen and then it just, the Bundaman ran away. You can no longer catch it. You'll have to wait for another one to show up. Wait another three hours before another Bundaman shows up. Bundaman, I mean, it's, it's right there. You, you stupid child. Uh, I just want to be your friend, Mr. Bunderman. You seem like a fun... I think he sees the word, Barnaby. <laughs> oh my god. There it goes. Get back here, Mr. Bunderman. Okay, I don't think I have ever seen anything more wholesome than Barnaby calling a Bunderman. Mr. Bunderman. And honestly, I... I don't think this boy could be more precious if he tried. What do Bundamans even eat? Carrots? No, I think they just eat about anything, right? That's what we learned in our fourth year when there was an infestation in Hagrid's hut. Did they just consume everything? Did you see where it went? It's literally right there. It's in front of you, Kiara. Sarai so tried to scare the Bundaman towards me. It's going in a circle. I don't think we... Stupid. Blimey, I missed. Okay. Okay, what is this nonsense? Ha! Huh. That is such a small and slow target. You can't even get that. There it is. Stupefy. What is wrong with you people? It, it, it took you, it's going to take you 8 hours to catch a single... It's such a slow moving target. I am insulted at you. I am insulted for you people. Except you, Barnaby. You are still the best. 8 hours later and you people have still not caught this Bundaman. You are so useless. I am I'm not even kidding you people are such, use, such useless people. Yes, we have been trying to do that exactly for the last 8 hours. Quick, cast stupefy. I can't believe it took you people this long. I have... Yes, what? Is Barnaby the only good thing about this entire trio? Oh jeez, we did it, we caught a Bundaman. Now we just need to extract some moves. 
How exactly does one do that? I don't recall learning about it. My thoughts exactly. I was thinking like, what's we catch up on? But how are we gonna get the use in out? Use out. I know how. <laughs> My grandma used to make me catch the bundamans in a shed for oxide. Isn't bundaman use acidic? <laughs> it can rot the structure of a building. That's the secret of the use, you know. I am a little impressed that Barnaby is referencing Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. I mean, the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles show was going on in the 1980s too. So I am impressed. He's. I am still impressed. He's referencing that. <laughs> Luckily, I have my dragon head gloves with me. I should only take a moment to juice the bandaman. How do you do that? You just carry dragon head gloves with you, Barnaby. I'm not surprised. He does like playing with teachers. It's not too strange. I always carry a lunar scope. Interesting. Awkward silence. <laughs> All done. There should be enough bandaman loose for the big batch of oxide. And therefore, you are a genius, and I love you. But I already loved you anyway. Fantastic. Thank you, Barnaby. You are actually the best. Barney Bay and I will check in with Madame Pomfrey about the doxy bite victims. And I'll head to the potion classroom right away. It's time to brew the doxyside and get rid of the doxies. If there was any doubt that Barnaby is the best, here it is. Barnaby is literally the best. He is the best. I feel like Ben got detention again. Professor Snape, I have the bundaman who's to make the doxyside. At least you're not totally incompetent. What a way to begin a conversation, honestly. Mm. Hi, Sarahi. Hi, Ben. What are you doing here? Did you get detention again? Mm. I have brought the doxy problem from Kiara. Thought I would lend a hand. If you two are quite done with your idle chatter, tell me the first step of brewing doxy, said Mr. Copper. Even I don't know that. Mm. Using the bundle and adding the juice to the cauldron. Start with me. Correct. Well done, Ben. I don't know. God damn it! I need to get my phone again. The phone's battery is dead, so I'm just looking it up on the monitor that's behind this phone. Uh, so juice the bundiman. Okay, after that, after that, it's grind the steeler shells. Oh, and add to the cauldron. Okay, so it's steeler shells. Okay, okay, okay. Um, add the steeler shells. You grind the steeler shells and add them to the cauldron. Correct. At least you paid attention in your third year. I didn't. Good job, Sri. Oh. It is very rare to see Ben smile these days. Well, I would prefer more competent assistance. You two will do. Let's begin brewing the rock shed. I don't think you're going to find people more competent than MC. I don't know about Ben, but you're not going to find anything more than MC, unless you're just asking for penny. And to be fair, I think MC has. I think Sarahi at least is very good at brewing doxy side now, because she has practiced like a bazillion times. Not to mention, she's also had to make antidotes for doxy shad because Barnaby used to keep drinking them. That smells like a carbon essence. We carbon essence. We need that soon. Looks like we're almost out of dragon liver. There's just enough here for us. Okay. Have you met Victor? He completely reinvented himself. Have you? Your friend Cory seems okay, if not a little optimistic and loud. Hey, I like optimistic and loud. I am optimistic and loud. Hey, so I don't think I need notes to brew doxy head. Like I said, I I think Sarai is probably have it memorized by now. Careful with the hemlock. I have no desire to take you to the infirmary. <sighs> Keep studying or I'll talk about sports. Okay, Ben is literally about to throw hands. <laughs> Can you do double check on the measurements for me, Sarahi? It would actually be very entertaining to see Ben just throw hands with Snape one time. Like I don't want Ben throwing hands at Dark Wizards. I want Ben to throw hands with Snape. That will be more entertaining. Brilliant! Now that the doxy head is complete, we can get rid of the doxy infestation. Seems like we have enough too. This batch will be potent enough to utilize the doxy queen and nothing more. The doxy queen? Pardon? 
Are you truly this ignorant with all your professors and my the unlucky one? I don't answer that. I don't care. <laughs> a doxy infestation usually means it's a doxy queen somewhere. I see. All this preparation will be useless if you don't properly remove the doxy queen. Well, I want to help my friends and save the school, so I need to track her down right away. Only I knew where to start. I think we'll know where to start soon. Srahi, we need to talk. What's wrong, Kiara? Have there been more doxy bite victims? Yes, but that's not why I'm. That's not why I'm here. Doxies have been spotted in Peeves' room. We need to hurry if you want to catch them. Lead the way, Kiara. We can't let anyone get bitten by the doxies. If we're lucky, maybe we'll find the Doxy Queen too, and Hogwarts can back get, get back to normal. Where has Hogwarts ever been normal, to be honest? Wait, I the chapter is. O- yep, this is the equivalent of the prank arc from Year Five. I am. I. I. Oh my God! Did I really spend an half an hour on this? This recording is thirty-six minutes long, and did I really just spend it doing that? That wasn't even fun. Though I will say the only good thing about this chapter was the fact that Barnaby is the best boy. That's it. I have nothing more to say. So that was it. Um, this is year uh, what chapter is this again? Year seven, chapter seventeen. That's it. The only good thing about this chapter was the Barnaby is the best boy. Like, sorry, I reiterated that. Um, and it is my birthday tomorrow. Happy birthday to me. I'm gonna get old. Er. Uh, I can't even finish words anymore. My brain isn't working. I've been recording for 37 minutes, and my brain isn't still fully awake. Isn't fully awake yet. And that's why I can't string sentences together. I'm going to edit this, and I'm going to realize I sound like a complete moron. Okay, that's it for this chapter. I hope you enjoyed. This was a filler chapter. I don't really think it's that entertaining. Um, but for the most part, hey, I tried. Even though I, my brain is still kind of asleep. I am so that's it and I'll see all of you next week and hopefully we'll find a chapter more entertaining bye bye have a nice day